In this video, we're going to discuss committed use discounts and sustained use discounts. We'll provide a brief explanation of what they are, how to use them, and how to track them in your billing account. Let's get started. First up, committed use discounts, or CUDs, provide discounted prices for certain cloud services in exchange for committing to a consistent amount of usage for a one- or three-year period. There are two types of CUDs, spend-based and resource-based. Spend-based CUDs provide a discount in exchange for your commitment to spend a minimum amount for a service each month. They are purchased and measured in terms of dollars per hour. A limited number of services support spend-based commitments, such as Cloud SQL. As you can see in this example Cloud SQL CUD, the commitment amount is defined based on the on-demand price. You then agree to pay a monthly discounted fee for the commitment for the duration of the term. For some services, like Cloud SQL, the CUD is purchased for a specific region and is applied towards all service usage within that region. Other cloud services apply spin-based CUDs towards all usage across all regions. Resource-based CUDs, on the other hand, provide a discount in exchange for your commitment to run a certain amount of resources continuously each month. For example, Compute Engine CUDs are measured in terms of the amount of resources such as vCPUs and memory and work on most Compute Engine machine types, including predefined and custom machine types. You can make separate commitments for GPUs and local SSDs as well. Discounts apply to the aggregate number of vCPUs, memory, GPUs, and local SSDs within a region, so they are not affected by changes to your instance's machine setup. Like some spin-based CUDs, resource-based CUDs are purchased on a per-region basis. Let's head into the console and see how to view, purchase, and track usage for your CUDs. First up, spending-based CUDs. We'll start with viewing your CUDs. For this task, you must be a billing account administrator or billing account viewer on the cloud billing account. From the navigation menu, select Billing. If you have more than one cloud billing account, choose the billing account for which you'd like to view associated CUDs. Then in the left-hand navigation menu, select Commitments. On the Commitments landing page, you will see a summary of your committed use discounts by commitment type. To view a detailed analysis of a specific spin-based commitment, you can select it from the list. Next up, to purchase spin-based CUDs, you must be a billing account administrator for the account. At the top of the screen, click Purchase. This will bring up a dialog box. Choose the product in the drop-down and then complete the details. Review the commitment summary and terms and then click Purchase. Finally, to analyze spin-based CUDs, you must be a billing account administrator or billing account viewer on the cloud billing account. In the left-hand navigation menu, select Commitment Analysis. This page shows the details of the selected commitment for the period specified in the filter including summary cards, a stacked bar chart, and a summary table of the commitment's totals. More details on reading the analysis page can be found in the documentation linked below. Next up, viewing, purchasing, and analyzing resource-based commitments for Compute Engine. To view commitments for Compute Engine, you must be a Compute Admin or Compute Viewer on the project in which you purchased the commitments. Make sure you have selected the correct project. Then head to the left-hand navigation menu and choose Compute Engine, then Committed Use Discounts. This will bring you to a list of your commitments, their status, and additional details. To purchase commitments for Compute Engine, you must be a Compute Admin on the project or a project owner. To purchase a machine type commitment, click the Purchase Commitment button at the top of the page. Name your commitment and complete the details, then click Purchase. To analyze your Compute Engine commitments, you can use the same process as spin-based commitments. This means you must be a billing account administrator or billing account viewer on the cloud billing account associated with the project containing the commitments. From the navigation menu, select Billing. Choose the billing account associated with the project. In the left-hand navigation menu, select Commitments. Then click on Compute Engine Commitment Analysis. This page shows the details of the selected commitment for the period specified in the filter, including summary cards, a stacked bar chart, and a summary table of the commitment's totals. This is also where you can change the scope of your Compute Engine CUDs from project level, which is default, to billing account level. 
With discount sharing enabled, the CUDs apply across all eligible usage and all projects associated with this billing account. Any Compute Engine resources that do not qualify for committed use discounts automatically qualify for sustained use discounts. Sustained use discounts are automatic discounts for running specific Compute Engine resources a significant portion of the billing month. Sustained use discounts give you up to 30% off, whereas committed use discounts give you up to 57% to 70% off. SUDs require no commitment and are applied automatically when you meet the requirements through your resource usage, without any action on your part. SUDs will automatically appear on your bill at the end of the billing cycle. You can view your sustained use discounts on the cost breakdown page located in the left-hand nav. Head over to the documentation to check out more details.